All right, so now the Infrex Plus has been around for a couple of years. Correct. The Infrex FRM represents brand new cutting edge technology in electrotherapy. This is great for athletes, uh, right. people that are into sports, fitness, uh, people that go to gyms and work out. Rehabilitation. And the, the weekend warrior. Yes. So in the hands of a coach, a trainer, a personal trainer, um, somebody that works with athletes and people that are into fitness, th this, this could be a, a great, uh, great tool. Yeah, absolutely. Because, I mean, we've got some some cases where people have used electrotherapy mm -hmm. and I remember one we got a, a, a really great trainer out in Seattle Washington mm -hmm. that he was telling me about a they were going to cast the poor patient for a, it was a high ankle sprain I believe mm -hmm. and they were going to cast and it was going to be like eight or nine weeks before the cast came off yeah and instead the patient was back participating mm -hmm. in five weeks but it was an and this is not unusual Right. This this is going on. Oh, we've got a little quote. I think is at the beginning of this video. If it's not at the end, mm -hmm. what we're doing is observing things that many people have observed. Right. But we're seeing something different, and that was Albert Saint Gorky. Right. And but that was his big thing. Is you know what is a researcher? We're right. somebody that observes the same thing differently. And that's what we're seeing with the infraxis. If a person works out, they're, they're actually kind of tearing down their muscles. And, and one of the keys is to recover quicker. Right. Right. And, th and this can help with that. Yeah. And, you know, and where I say you look at things differently, mm -hmm. you look at a person that's got a broken bone, they get ready to chop their leg off mm -hmm. because they're crushed in a motorcycle injury. You don't want to use your leg, lose your leg. Right. So one of the things they've used for a long time is electricity to make it heal. We look at people with soft bone, with soft tissue injuries, decubitus ulcers. Mm -hmm. Nutrition's always important. Got to have nutrition. Right. But they apply what then was called high voltage or pulse galvanic stimulation, mm -hmm. they, and the, the bed sores heal. Well, the processes of healing, be it a bone or be it soft tissue, mm -hmm. when you exercise, when you condition, yeah. It's the same processes. The healing mechanisms are occurring on the subatomic level. They're occurring where electrons are, where electrons pass. So it's nothing new. It's just right. trying to understand what's going on so that we can maximize the way we do it, right. so that we can maximize patient positive outcomes. There's uh, people that uh, they put the electrodes on their body, right? Mm -hmm. And then uh, some of these folks are doing exercises. Yep. So there's, they're doing muscle strengthening exercises while right. they have the electrodes on their body. What, what kind of uh, results are you seeing from that? Oh, then that's, that's the old Russian stem. But you can also see this with multiple sclerosis patients. Uh, and that's important because they're regaining function. Now, there's a whole, you can look at, uh, matter of fact, I'll put it right here so everybody can see it. They can click here and you can see the multiple sclerosis tape that explains myelin regeneration. Mm -hmm. But this whole process is a process of rehabbing quicker. Right. Now, when you actually, and one of our videos alludes, when you have a patient exercise, mm -hmm. they're working hard, but right. they're not recruiting all the motor fibers. When right. you, and, the, and you work from the smallest fiber up to the largest fiber as your resistance increases. Right. When we use the Infrex machines, mm -hmm. we already have them working the natural way. Mm -hmm. We overstimulate the larger fibers. Mm -hmm. So what we're actually doing is we're in, in we're engaging, enabling the patient to cut down the rehab, get better, get mm -hmm. back, and if they keep a maintenance program up, right. probably increase their strength greater than it ever has been. Right. So this can be used even like on a sideline, say during a football game or something where an injury takes place and they're carting the poor fellow sure. off the field. That actually comes with a uh, 
portable battery pack. Battery pack. So yeah. You, you could sit right there on the sidelines, hook up the electrodes, reduce pain, uh, and, and get, some, get some therapeutic effect going on right off the bat. Yeah, Jeff, and one of the things, I mean, and you see this constantly, and we talk to our patients occasionally, mm -hmm. and this is one of the things we emphasize to them, to them following rehabilitation, mm -hmm. following injury, it's inevitable. Mm -hmm. They're going to put cold on them. Mm -hmm. After 24, 48 hours, they generally put a warm, moist heat on these patients. Mm -hmm. Well, think this one through. Mm -hmm. One of the reasons for cold was to stop some of the inflammatory process. Mm -hmm. But there's always pain. Right. So use the units in mm -hmm. conjunction with your thermal modalities. Right. Now, the real neat benefit is if you had a patient exercising mm -hmm. and you had, say they were trying to move their shoulder and they couldn't, but you, they, they liked warm, moist heat, mm -hmm. put some electrodes on them. Right. The heat brings the blood. The blood, electricity loves liquids, loves water. Right. That increases the depth of penetration, but it increases patient comfort. Your conductivity. Yes, you've increased conductivity. Mm -hmm. Now, if the patient, if you give them the ability to control the intensity, right. as their pain level increases, they can increase the intensity to get greater range of motion. It may be only two or three degrees, right. but that's significant. And that's where if they use these things conjunctively or complementary, mm -hmm. you greatly enhance patient outcomes. At MedFax, our priority is to educate and inform on topics such as pain relief, sports performance, injury rehab, nutrition, antioxidants, electron supplementation, and electrotherapy. We carry a complete line of electrotherapy devices and accessories including interferential, TENS, ultrasound, muscle stimulators, electrodes, and more. We are excited about being on the cutting edge of electrotherapy research. 